Hey guys, welcome back. I released a video the other day about reshade. Um, I then realized about an hour later that I fucked up. So here we are again. Okay guys, so we're gonna cover the installation of reshade. So if you have a look at the link that's in the description of this video at the bottom, um, you will see this article. Okay, so we just want to scroll down and download Reshade. So let's click on that guy. Download, download, download. Here we go. So, as you can see here, we have the reshade setup. We're going to run that. The easiest way to get your Steam folder location is you go to your Steam account. We're going to go to uh, properties of Player Unknowns. We just go to local files and go browse local files. That's going to give us this location. Okay. So, let's just copy that. Then go back to reshade, we'll select here, type that in into the file name, just click open, it's going to bounce you straight in here. Let's go to TSL game, we'll go binaries, win64, we hit the TSL game.exe. Uh, yours probably won't say exe, I've actually set mine up to have file extensions for known file types. Um, generally, um, you're probably going to want to select uh, Direct 3D 10 Plus. Um, if you don't know what to choose, that is the option that you're choosing. Uh, and we're going to, I've already had an installation. I'm going to override that now. You probably won't have that message. Um, and we do want to download these uh, standard effects. Uh, now, this is where I'm going to install a little bit different to what's in the guide. Now, the guide tells you just to unselect everything and only select the ones that you want. Um, I've, I've installed this a couple of times now, uh, and I can, I can now say that it's not going to be the easiest way. You just want to click OK. So, we've done that. OK, so that's all done. You can just close this window. So, let's go back to the game. Okay, guys, we are in the game. So, once you get into the game, you're just going to want to click your, or sorry, push your shift and F2 button. Okay, so once you do that, you'll see this pop up. Um, basically, we just want to create a new profile first of all. We're just going to call it Reshade. All of your settings here, um, all of these mods will probably be in a different order for you guys. But you basically just want to turn on Clarity, Luma Sharpen, Vibrance, Adaptive Sharpen, HDR or Fake HDR, and Technicolor. Okay. You then want to jump down into this little settings pane down the bottom. You want to close all of these little tabs all the way up until you find your Technicolor and you want to open that guy. Okay. Now this one will be on one for you guys you just want to click and drag your mouse until this says 0 0.5 uh, and that will be uh, a pretty good value now the other thing I want to note here is that if you guys are using digital vibrance with the NVIDIA control panel you'll probably find you don't need vibrance it's essentially doing the same thing um, yeah, you might find that it's a little bit too much on the desert map. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and let me know what you think in the comments.